Hello, my name's James Butler from Pura Facades, and I'm going to talk to you today about GRC, or Glass Reinforced Concrete to give it its full name, it is, as the name suggests, a concrete mix, i.e. sand, cement, water and additives, but this time you have the addition of a glass fibre mesh or shards which give it the rigidity and strength required to make it a facade material on a building. For the purposes of this video, we're going to be looking at four main types of architectural concrete facade materials. Number one, cast concrete. Number two, spray GRC. Number three, lightweight GRC. And number four, ultra high performance concrete known as UHPC. Let's look at each of these in a bit more detail. Cast concrete most closely resembles stone. It's thick, heavy and dense and offers probably the widest range of different surface finishes. Cast concrete most closely resembles natural stone. It's also the most expensive to buy and to put on the building and probably takes the longest to manufacture. Second in our list is spray GRC. This does closely resemble cast concrete but is manufactured in a different way. It's manufactured by spraying a concrete mix around a core filler such as polystyrene to create the same size and geometry that you would have with a cast concrete piece. The advantage being it's slightly lighter. While spray GRC also comes in a range of colours and textures, it's fair to say that there can be inconsistencies in colour and texture due to the manual manufacturing process. It also comes with a fairly long manufacturing lead time. The third product we're looking at is lightweight GRC, sometimes referred to as extruded. It uses two layers of glass fibre mesh. This strengthens the product and enables it to be considerably thinner than spray or cast concrete. This means that it weighs less and therefore it's quicker and easier to put on the building. The benefit of lightweight GRC is that it can be moulded into a variety of shapes and geometries at a surprisingly low cost. It's also quicker to manufacture and install on the building. Our final product in this overview is UHPC or Ultra High Performance Concrete. This product is light, super strong and often comes in highly smoothed finishes. Whilst architects will like the flexibility that this lightweight and strong material offers, it doesn't suit the more typical concrete look and feel and is quite costly to manufacture. Architects can also use GRC to create aesthetical interest and depth to a facade which has become more important of late, not just because it's aesthetically pleasing, but also because it creates shade to a building and helps control the temperature. It's important with the resurgence of GRC that specifiers understand the wide breadth of choice that we now have in architectural concrete facade materials, especially with the new kids on the block like the lightweight GRC options which are more cost effective and quicker to manufacture and produce.